Hi guys, welcome to the Wawelos. This is a YouTube channel where we discuss issues, relationships, and the rest. And our motto is always to live, rape, and change lives. So today, I want us to talk about something neutral. I was going through Facebook, and I happened to come across this case, which was being handled by Wakili Wahome Goku. And I think you guys have seen that post where a guy has been jailed for 15 years for sleeping in a 15 years old guy. So this case, let me just give you a little bit of history. This case started back in COVID-10. When two girls sneaked out, went to visit some guys. So they sneaked out during curfew and they managed to evade the police box. And they were able to go to a certain place where they are guys and they enjoyed themselves the whole night. So after they came back in the morning, the parents of these girls insisted to know where these girls were. So it came out that one of the girls, after being pushed by parents, I said, more query that she had, she had had. Uh, intercourse with them, uh, one of the guys called Brian. I uh, hear it's the real name. So, when they went to police, when they went to hospital, everything was proven it's true. They slept with Brian, blah 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 blah, all that. So, the, it was taken to court. Remember, the girls are from a very good family. So, they were taken to court. And after all the judgment, the guy Brian was acquitted because the girl, we understand it's true, the girl was 15 years old. That was back during the coffee, but she was she had gone with her with an elder lady who was past the same. So the questions which rose about was if this girl was able to evade police products, it means she acted like a mature person. If this girl was able to drink because it's hard that that night they drank, it means this girl acted like a mature person. So and this girl didn't talk until the parents pressed her to talk, meaning she acted like a mature person. And that's why this guy Brian and the lawyers from inside were able to acquit him. So he was not dead. Fact. Fast forward to around sometimes this year. The girl is 19 now. The 15 years girl is 19. But unfortunately, she is abroad and Brian, the case will return. Brian was caught and Brian was jailed for 15 years. Big defilement. Simple. The question people was asking is, was the judgment fair to Brian? And if you ask me, the judgment was not fair to Brian. Point blank. Because the girl acted more mature. And the reason as we have decided to look at this case is because we are in a holiday season and we will have all wannabes and the summer bunnies who are coming to the villages or to towns. And there are these girls who are in your sana. So what I can advise men, the judgment doesn't care. And you don't know who are the parents of this girl or who is behind these girls. So no matter what you do, always use your cogosity. Zip up. But if you have to do it, unless it's somewhere around Koinanke Street or somewhere around River Road, where we meet Yanika, don't try unless I'm a kuja kama ameuma ID na mapamu. Otherwise, you'll be in for it and you'll start discussing your case that you are discussing prior. So, it's the high time as guys we realize that the constitution is so unfair to men, the society is so unfair to men. So, in whatever you do, remember, the repercussions will be for you alone. So, take care for this season. And ladies, please, to me, a cogosity. Because it's very rare for these young ladies, 15, 16, and 17 and below. These things do not start from somewhere. These things, they are supported by an elder lady, Mr. Kula Kula, Tumia Kahibi, 20, 21, 23, 24. They support these young ladies. And it's very difficult for this lady to go around. So what happens? Kuna mtu watam sukuma na kuna mtu watanza kumpereka kwa machari. So as a guy, be very careful. Because that's how temptations comes. And you can depart on my wagwa dani ni yaka kumina tano. In short, where you daka, mbaka you get a new so president, or perhaps you meet another cities. So the whole essence is, guys, it's the high time. No matter how far you may deeper, always think twice. Don't put yourself in that. Otherwise, uta kaskia, uta kula mahalaga kamete. But because of that, wacha ni kumi soda ni tafute homa. Keep it up, guys. Bye. We have a promise until 25th. So guys, keep checking on this channel for some such. Highlights. Otherwise, to me, bongo. The space between your ears, let it not be a dispenser of mucus and tears. But if you do so, it will be a dispenser. Bye. Subscribe, share, and like. Thank you. I've forgotten. Thank you.